Alright, can't be fucked show my face. This is just people are doing reviews and takes on video game consoles like the Series X and S and PS5 that haven't played them. I just read some of a Dr. Disrespect article and he's saying that Microsoft should sell up and hand it over to PS5 and what I've learned from Dr. Disrespect is he's a money hungry bastard that gets donations it's like a basically a gaming prostitute and um yeah so my take on a console is i can't really say until i've played both and he should be that um subjective and that open-minded and people should shouldn't be saying what they think about a console if they haven't used it and um you know ps5's got some exclusives um on launch and they've got exclusives a few more exclusives in the xbox coming out in the near future but that's only for the near future like microsoft buying um bethesda and getting up multiple gaming studios with that title and um so what am i trying to say it's really late i'm watching hannibal so what i'm trying to say is fuck up you fucking mong fucking whore cunt grabbing money off little kids' parents and shit that little kids using mum and dad's credit cards, asking for donations like a fucking hooker. Should be ashamed of himself. So I like both the Xbox One and the PlayStation 4. I've got both. And I don't have an Xbox X, uh, One X or anything like that. So I can only say I like both consoles. There's some things I like about the Xbox and there's some things I like about the PlayStation. So I'm a gamer that uses both consoles. And I'm not going to um, not use one because of what some twat says. And they both have their merits. And mm, So I don't know. I think PlayStation should be worried with the moves the Xbox is making. And um, they need to step up their game. And like I was talking to about the other day, you know, um, Nintendo tried to monopolise the gaming industry back in the fucking early 90s and they, for people to buy licenses, is really expensive and um, food parties and blah, blah, blah. And they were going to have a Nintendo PlayStation fucking retard thingy anyway. But the thing I'm trying to say is they got greedy and they lost control of the market because of it. And, um... Having multiple companies instead of one company having a monopoly over gaming is bad for the consumer. And um, <clears throat> always turns out ugly companies get too greedy and fucking whatever. But that's my waffle. And um, I'm looking forward to both the PlayStation 5 and the Xbox X. I'm getting the Xbox X first. And then, what's well, because I'm poor, so I can't get them both at the same time otherwise. And well, then I'm going to get the PS5. Um, yeah, so that's my two cents. Blah.